Okay, dear children, let's go to the next question, example 2. Here, all of you read the question. Two coins are two simultaneously 500 times and we get two head. This is the outcome. See how we are getting two head 105 times, one head 275 times, no head that is tail, okay, 120 times. Now, the question is find the probability of occurrence of each of these events. Now, you see, we have three events, two head one head and no head so we have to find the probability of two head one head and no head okay so your total outcome is here 500 times because we have to the coin how many times 500 times total okay so now here we go the solution okay so i have written the question also here so you can also write the question from your book okay so let's go to the solution direct solution given first you have to write total outcome your total outcome is 500 times it is already given in the question i have told you after that now you see in the first case therefore two head First, we have to find the probability of two head. You see here, two head. Two head is how many times? 105 times, is not it? So, two head, that is your favorable outcome. So, you write in the bracket, favorable outcome equal to 105. This is the first case, okay? So, we know the formula. Therefore, probability of occurrence of two head. Then, two head, how many times we are getting probability? How many times we'll get? Equal to formula, favorable outcome by total outcome, okay? So, your favorable outcome means two head, you are getting 105. You write 105 in the numerator and denominator total outcome. That is 500. You write 500 in the denominator. So, you cut it by 5. 5 will cancel 105. How many times? 21 times. 21 times. 10 divided 5 2 times and 5 1 time. 21 times and 500 divided by 500 times. Is not it? So, 21 by 100 we got. 21 by 100. As I have already told you before also, see here now we have 2 0. Very simple. You cut this 2 0 and place the point before 2 number. 1 2 point. Okay. So, we got the answer 0 0.21. Got it? So, this is the probability of getting 2 head. And now, we we'll shall go to the next one. Therefore, now 1 head. See, now next one is 1 head. 1 head. Favorable outcome. How many times? How many times we got one head? Look at the question. One head, 275 times. Okay. So, this is your favorable outcome in the second case. One head, favorable outcome in the bracket you write. That is 275. After that, therefore, probability of occurrence of one head. Same to same. Here, one head. Okay. Probability of occurrence of one head. Now, we have to find the probability of getting one head. Equal to formula, favorable outcome by total outcome. Your favorable outcome is 275 total outcome is 500 again here also you cut it by 5 275 divided by 5 how many times 55 times and 500 how many times by 500 times so we got 55 by 100 so you write here 55 by 100 similarly you cut this to 0 and place the point before two number got it then we got point 0 0.55 so before 0 before point you can give 0 okay so 0 0.55 here in the first case 0 0.21 okay so now the last part now getting no head no head means tail you have to understand getting no head means tail so here no head see here therefore no head so getting no head means how many time 120 times is not it in your question you can see the getting no head see getting no head is how many time no head means 120 times see no head 120 times so that is your favorable outcome our favorable outcome now is 120 okay getting no head okay so therefore probability of occurrence of no head now you have to write here no heads okay no head not heads only head no head and equal to formula favorable outcomes by total outcome Favorable outcome is 120, you write 120. Total outcomes is 500, you write 500. Similarly, you cut it by 5, by 5 you cancel 120, 24 times, 500, 100 times. So, you got 24 by 100. Now, as before, 20 cancel and before 2 number points. So, what is the answer now? 0 0.24. This is the probability of getting no head. Understood? So, we got the 3 answer. Answer number 1, 2 head. Answer number two, answer number two, answer number one. First, answer number one, uh, two head, two head answer is 0 0.21. And after that, getting what? One head answer is 0 0.55. And the last one is getting what? 
no head no head means tail that is your answer is 0 0.24 so this is example number two okay i hope all of you have understood i'm going to send you this photo also first you watch and listen the video carefully and try to understand okay formula you have to remember favorable outcome by favorable outcome by total outcome this is the only formula in this less than probability okay so that's all now after that i'll go to the last question from the example okay thank you